All right, good. Uh, just a quick video here. Just been down to Bunnings to buy some stuff, and every now and then when I go down there, I'll see a little bargain. So I'll just show you a couple of things we got just now. Um, first one. These are the uh, Irwin. A square drive bit 10 pack. Uh, I'll just take one out. Hang on, I'll get one out. Hang on, here we go. I'm hoping this is the right size because I've got this is what I have. I've got these screws which I didn't realize I had. And they are a square drive. I found these <coughs> square drive bits that fit into there. And I thought, great. But I like, I like the longer ones. These ones are a bit short. So I've got a 10 pack of these suckers, the old air ones. And I'm hoping, yeah, that fits. That's good. Uh, 10 pack. five bucks there's still a few packs down there bunning sale so go and check that out that's good the other week um, I went down here to get some drill bits I needed an SDS bit for me uh, rotary hammer drill these Irwin SDS shank a very good bit five dollars each so I loaded up on that there's a 10 miller how many of those we got three ten millers and I've got a longer one there that's an eight mil uh, with a longer fluting on it and that suits that blue stuff in the corner which is the eight mil spaghetti it's just like uh, raw plugs so that was a bargain five dollars each unreal that's good I've got that and oh, I needed a three mil drill bit you go and try and buy a three mil drill bit and they're uh oh i don't know 10 bucks for two or something 15 bucks for two double enders so i just got a cheap set look i only use mine for wood mainly so uh for doing pilot holes for screws but i just bought this little set here it's got a um three mil 3.2 and a 3.5 and those three will do me for those uh pilot holes and then you get the rest of them that was uh 10 bucks i mean they're cheap quality but for the timber they're fine and then i saw these on the shelf and we've got one at work it's called a die grinder at work they call it but um they, this, they call this one a straight air grinder kit it just looks like a die grinder to me so i've got that 15 bucks or 14 dollars 97 or whatever it was so i'm just going to open it up now and have a squiz apparently it comes with bits have a look there we go there it is Little. Yeah, tiny little bugger. It's got a safety on it. Press that forward. Uh, looks like a. I don't know what size that is. It's got a remove cap. It says there. Anyway, I'll suss that out, and then it comes with instructions. It's a uh, three-year replacement warranty for home use. So if you, if you break down in three years, or over three years, you take it back with your receipt and you get a new one. I'll just replace it for you. All right, there's little tools to undo the collet. That's good. And then oh, you get two different size collets by the look of it, and a box full of um, grinding stones. 1497 15 bucks bargain so i've been doing some welding so i'll probably use i'll probably for clean up with there's too much weld on there i want to get some off probably use some of these here to do that but that's pretty good i'll um i'll fire up the compressor and we'll try it out right yeah i just realized what it meant by remove cap in the bottom so I had this little cap, just a rubber cap in there like that. It says remove caps, pull that out. And that's where the um, the fitting goes for your compressor. 
which I've got here, that was in this box. Uh, I'll just put a bit of teff on there so it doesn't leak. It's got a filter inside there to stop any crap getting inside it. So I'll whack that in. Tighten that up. This will be interesting. Good, get more. That should be plenty. And then your tools for your collets. I'll just put this on here. It's a lot easier to work with. Put that over there like that. Right, good, and down we go there. So, these are probably pretty loose anyway, so here we go. I'll try that one. That's for steel. Put that in there. Just leave that a little bit. Tighten it up by hand. And get the tool on it. <coughs> Shouldn't need to do these too tight. Just nip them up. That should be plenty. That's good. It says it runs on um, medium air pressure. So that probably says it in the manual, but I've used one of these at work. So I think my compressor should do it. It does 180 litres a minute. So it's one of those high pressure ones that's good all right let's uh, hook her up no leaks that's good that's that's what the teflon does no leaks at all I just turned that compressor, uh, let the compressor run until it filled. I just want to see, so that's full now. I just want to see when it kicks in. I'll keep the trigger down and see how long it lasts. Well, I don't think it's going to be too long because it's all it's free airflow. So most air tools like this do that, but we'll see what it does. Here we go. That's not too bad. I mean, it lasted a little while until it kicked in, but the um, reason I bought this is because of I've been doing some welding and um, like cleaning up the edges of here on the outside of a bit of steel. No worries at all. You can do that with your normal grinder. They come up pretty good, but if I'm trying to do an internal internal weld like that, ooh, like that. It's a bit hard. I tried cleaning it up with the grinder as you can see, but it's a bit hard to get it. So I'm going to try this die grinder and see what happens. So I'm just going to reposition. Hang five. Alright, all set up there. I just had a quick read of that manual. It's pretty straightforward. That's it. Uh, it says, says put Teflon tape on. Did that. That's good. Uh, and I'll just put a couple of drops of oil in the airline itself inside the tool. It says to do that. And other than that, I'm pretty well, I was pretty good. That's that. Now, yep. compressor's going to fire up, so excuse it. Um, I don't know if you can see that. Maybe getting a bit closer. Let's get her a bit closer there. Over there. I'll try that. Anyway, that's, where's that torch? I don't know if you can see it. It looks shit out anyway, so. I'll give this a go and see what, I'll just do it on half. Compressor started up. I literally did whatever you saw there, and that's all I did grinding it. So 
Let me just get this down here. Oh, down we go. And up we go. That'll do. Get a bit closer. Okay, I'm trying to get a good shot here. That's actually not bad. Um, I smoothed it out pretty good compared to the other side. Not bad at all. It gives it a nice little round over there. Yeah, you can see it a bit better now. Anyway, I'm happy with that. 15 bucks. Beautiful. Three year replacement warranty. Bang. I think that's all I've got at the moment. If I come across any more bargains, I'll let you know. Um, yeah, look for the yellow tags and bunnies. Looking good. Alrighty, we'll catch up with you.